Have you ever pondered what lies beyond the edge of the universe, a question that has kept the best minds in science awake at night? To unravel this enigma, let's first understand what we mean by the edge of the universe. When we speak of an edge, we're not talking about a physical boundary or a cosmic cliff where you might potentially fall into the abyss of nothingness. Rather, we refer to the observable universe. It's a sphere around us from which we've received light and other signals because the universe hasn't been around forever. It's approximately 13.8 billion years old. So we can only see things that are 13.8 billion light years away or less. That's our cosmic horizon. So what's beyond this horizon? Here's where it gets fascinating. One school of thought suggests that the universe is finite. If this were true, then there must indeed be some edge Albeit not in the conventional sense, according to this theory, if you travelled in a straight line across the universe, you would end up back at your starting point, much like circumnavigating the globe. On the other hand, some theories posit that the universe is infinite, stretching out without end. Imagine an endless expanse of stars, galaxies and celestial wonders going on forever. This idea is mind-boggling and almost impossible to comprehend, but it's a possibility nonetheless. In essence, the edge of the universe is more of a concept, a limit to what we can observe and understand. It's the threshold of our knowledge, the precipice of our comprehension. So, when we talk about what's beyond the edge, it's an exploration into the unknown, a journey beyond our current understanding of the universe. It's not a physical boundary, but a boundary of perception and comprehension. As our technology and understanding of the universe evolve, so too does our observable universe. The edge expands, pushing further into the vast unknown. So, the edge of the universe might just be a concept rather than a physical boundary. Intriguing, isn't it? If the universe is indeed infinite, what does that really mean? It's a question that leaves even the greatest minds scratching their heads. Let's break this down. The idea of an infinite universe suggests that space doesn't end but continues forever. Imagine a never-ending canvas stretching out into eternity. Our cosmos filled with stars, galaxies, nebulae and all sorts of celestial wonders just keeps going and going. This thought alone can rock our comprehension of space and time, challenging the boundaries of our understanding. Now, if the universe is infinite, it alters the way we view cosmology. Traditionally, we've always thought of the universe as a closed system, a bubble, if you will, with a definite start, think Big Bang, and a possible end. But an infinite universe throws this concept out of the window. Instead, we face a cosmos without bounds, without a beginning or an end, just an everlasting expanse of space and time. Now, let's get a bit more daring. An infinite universe could mean parallel universes exist. Yes, you heard that right. Parallel universes, realms where history has taken a different path, where another version of you could be living a completely different life. This idea stems from the multiverse theory, a concept that suggests our universe is just one of many, perhaps an infinite number, each with its own laws of physics. And it's not as far-fetched as it sounds. Quantum physics, the study of the tiniest particles in the universe, already hints at such possibilities. It's a field of study where particles can be in two places at once, where the act of observing something can change its state. If these quirks exist in our universe, who's to say what's possible in another? So if the universe is infinite, it could hold an infinite number of possibilities, including other versions of you and me. An infinite universe, an infinite number of wonders, it's a concept that stretches our imagination to its limits and beyond and makes us question our place in this vast cosmic tapestry. But what if the universe is not infinite? What if it's finite? In the realm of cosmology, there's a compelling argument that the universe may indeed be finite. That's a profound statement, isn't it? A universe with boundaries, a cosmos that doesn't stretch on forever but has limits. This concept might seem paradoxical, especially when we're used to thinking of the universe as an endless expanse of galaxies, stars and nebulae. So what does a finite universe imply? Well, it suggests that our cosmos is a self-contained entity a distinct bubble in the fabric of reality. This doesn't necessarily mean that the universe has walls or ends where you'd fall off, but rather that the space in which we reside has a definitive measure. Now, let's delve into the concept of the universe's curvature. The curvature of the universe is a key aspect in understanding the idea of a finite cosmos. In a flat or open universe, light travels in straight lines. 
But in a curved or closed universe, which is what a finite universe would be, light bends and follows the curvature. This implies that if you were to travel far enough in a straight line, you'd end up back where you started, much like circumnavigating the Earth. But how did this finite universe come into being? The prevalent theory is the Big Bang, a cosmic explosion that occurred about 13.8 billion years ago, giving birth to all the matter and energy we see today. This event marked the beginning of our universe and it has been expanding ever since. But it's important to note that this expansion isn't into something. It's the very fabric of space itself that is stretching. In a finite universe, this expansion could eventually slow, stop, and potentially reverse, leading to a cosmic contraction or big crunch. This signifies a possible end to our universe, a definitive conclusion to our cosmic story. A finite universe might mean that our cosmos is a self-contained entity with a definitive beginning and potential end. Regardless of whether the universe is finite or infinite, what could exist beyond its edge? This is the question that has intrigued scientists, philosophers and thinkers for centuries. The answer is not straightforward. Honestly, it's not. It's a complex web of theories, speculations and a great deal of unknown. One of the most popular theories is the concept of a multiverse. Imagine a cosmic bubble bath where each bubble represents a separate universe with its own laws of physics and unique cosmic recipe. It's a mind-boggling notion, isn't it? If our universe is just one bubble in an infinite cosmic foam, what could lie in the space between these bubbles? This brings us to the idea of other dimensions. String theory, for instance, suggests there could be as many as 10 or 11 dimensions, most of which we cannot perceive. These dimensions could host other realities parallel to our own, yet entirely separate. But perhaps the most unsettling theory is the concept of absolute nothingness. Beyond the edge of our universe, there could simply be an endless void, devoid of matter, energy, space or time, an eternal silence that has never been broken by the birth of a star or the death of a galaxy. These are, of course, just theories. They are the products of human imagination, fueled by our innate desire to understand the world around us. They are the best guesses we have based on our current understanding of the universe and the laws of physics. But it's important to remember that our knowledge is always evolving. Just a few centuries ago, the idea that the Earth revolves around the Sun was a revolutionary concept. Who knows what paradigm-shifting discoveries await us in the future? Beyond our universe could lie realms and realities that defy our current understanding of physics and reality. It's an exciting prospect, isn't it? It's a reminder that no matter how much we learn, there will always be more mysteries to unravel, more questions to ask, and more unknowns to explore. In the end, the question of what lies beyond the edge of the universe remains one of the greatest mysteries in science. In our journey today, we've navigated the edge of understanding, explored the concept of an infinite universe, and pondered upon the notion of a finite universe. We've dared to peek into the unknown beyond, to speculate about the potentialities that lie in the unfathomable depths of cosmic reality. We've grappled with complex astrophysical terms and theories, from quantum fluctuations to cosmic inflation, from multiverse hypotheses to string theory. We've seen how our understanding of the universe is constantly evolving, shaped by new discoveries and technological advancements. Yet, despite our ceaseless pursuit of knowledge, the universe continues to enchant us with its profound mysteries. It compels us to question, to explore, and to innovate. It reminds us that we are but humble explorers, dwarfed by the grandeur of the cosmos. As we continue to gaze at the stars, we remain explorers, seeking to understand the vast, mysterious cosmos that surrounds us.